come to Jamaica, the island of real bad man. Some real dog at you throw some real gang bang. No run for the fair, the knock your bitch. Step up. These are the moments oh. when everybody gun loaded. We not instigate violence, but we believe in the self defense no matter what. These are the moments when every gangster gun loaded. We not instigate violence, but we believe in the self defense. Welcome to True Island Stories. This is a video talking about some of the recent happenings and events uh, going on at the World Athletics Championship in uh, Budapest, Hungary. And uh, one of our 100 meter athletes, as uh, one of our 100 meter athletes, as, you know, came out and did a video that I think was very revealing, very telling and uh, exposing uh, some very horrifying things that are going on behind the scenes within the J3A, Jamaica Athletics Association. And I don't know what the other A stands for. Or is it Jamaica Amateur Athletics? I do not know. Put it in the comment section. One of the A missing something and I do not know what it is for the life of me. You know, but I'll get into Taekwondo was a rant. It wasn't really a rant. It was, well, it was a rant, but not a boisterous or, but I'll get into that and give my views on it before I show you the video. But first, let me congratulate Miss Danielle Williams who won the 100 meter hurdles in Budapest. She won the gold. Akira Nugent, you got fifth. You're very young. I know you're on a better time in college because trust me, I follow you in college. I follow all my Jamaican athletes in college. You feel me? Yes. So I know Akira. Akira won the NCAA 100 meter hurdles in college and she is young and she is sprightly, you know, but it was just on the day. That's hurdles, you know what I mean? But believe me, you're going to hear more about Akira. But Daniel, you won it in 2015. And let me tell you something, people. These are the times that makes me feel so glad to be Jamaican. So proud to be a Jamaican. You understand me? Yes, and we know a lot of our fellow citizens feel the same way. You know, when our athletes go out and do good, when our artists go out and do good, when anybody from Jamaica win anything international, you don't know how it unifies the country. And within that moment, nobody's dying. Nobody's getting hurt because we are too busy. We are too busy engulfed in what's going on with our athletes, you know? So believe me, when you guys go out there, win, lose, or draw, we're still proud of you. Ilian, same way. We know Ilian I got bounce back once you get a good team around her. You know, she got bounce back. Shellyan, we thank you for your years of service, brother. I mean, you put up on the map. Sherika come from four to around 100 meter and look poised to win the 200 meter and is a 200 meter Olympic champion or national champion, sorry. Believe me, our world athletic champion, sorry. And you have been doing it for so many years. I've been watching you from year in high school. Not that way. Take that out your mind you perv you know what i mean but i've been watching you performing since high school i've been watching you getting third in the athletics championship fourth and struggling some people don't say i know the story the only say the glory they don't i see your glory because i am a sports fanatic manchester united fan for years over 20 odd years i used to run track and field when I used to run Chuck and feel at Ulmas, Francis was the coach. Coach Francis. Yeah. Then time they used to have Delavante Brown. You understand? Who was a 110 meter hurdle. And I think, I don't know if he wanted a champs. Put it in the comment section. Delavante Brown. But humble youth. You know? And we had a good team back then. You know what I mean? So, I know Coach Francis long, long time from your youth at Ulmas. Parchment, you got a silver. But believe me, one of the icing and the cake. And I know Usain But I would have liked to say Usain Bolt. Usain, send me a celebration, please, and put it up. Because I know wherever you are, you and Bibi, because I know you left out Bibi, and Bibi left out and Pepe. Anyway, you know they are cheer. I know say in the so All of you know the supposed to be broken at all. You know the domino table is supposed to be broken. When they play domino, and Usain, you know, remember me tell you that judgment for that, that's enough. But I wonder if Usain got a domino play around there. Because I see my domino bone, and I wonder if Bibi, you see me, them good pack. Because I see Bibi, I'm going to go, go shoot six pass, maddy, you know, and table kick over. No, with Jamaican, but saying that to say, me know say Usain supposed to feel good and say yes, make him go my bed comfortable now. When Antonio Watson, 21 years old, one Bob, one Bob, one Bob, we may say 
Yo, if you print a shirt there and sell it out, copyright that. That is a famous saying. One bob. What me say? One bob. Rich a rich. One bob. Nobody knew of this dude. And I, I never watched the Charles. I never saw the 400 meter Charles. At least I watched most of them. I never saw the 400 meter final. I never knew of this dude till now. The rest of the dudes in the 400 meter hurdle, we have a young youth named Clark. Very young. And he handled himself well in the final. Just to make the final in a blood. He, he, a seven billion people in the world, you know. Just to even make the semi-final, you know. It's a great feat, you know. Even for God, you know. If you make the finals, seven billion people in the world. And you, you, you in the eight, you know, man, mental that is. You in the eight, you understand me? So, who and Bob, Antonio Watson, and guess what? Me know Hussein feel good. And him can say yes, him can hand over the keys now. Because guess what? Antonio Watson run for racers. And that's Coach Mills, that is Coach Mills who not discovered Hussein but helped put him on the map, rearrange him life, him career, him owe him everything to Coach Mills. I mean, no, Hussein is a kind youth, so but not financially for Mills, but the success, I know, said that must feel very gratifying to Hussein because you know, I said, I'm placed that one loyalty, one Hussein, in no go no else, him stay there, so till him retire. Yo, my real loyalty in the blood. My real loyalty, you know. That's why a certain story, my channel could have been bigger in the blood. But you see, if a pilgrim linked me and said to me, say, yo, man, okay, this no for God road. And you can't fight in me, blood. Not one man ever come out and point and say, me tell you, never if you say this, I say that. If it do that, I must miss you, I must never hear you. And if I something was, I go say, I go take it down. Because that make me feel dirty in myself, you know what I mean? I feel unclean. Yeah, man. So, Racers Club, congratulations, Coach Mills. Long time you know Coach Mills. From their camper down years, bro. Years, you know? And he just I get success now on the international stage since Usain the man. You know what I mean? You and Blake the man. He have oblique civil. So he have Zanel you. Zanel you we run for Britain. He come from one of them like a small island there. He got KC, he was a 100 meter champion. He came third in the 100 meter finals this year at Budapest. Zanel you run for England. But at Jamaica him grow. Him come from one of them small islands there. But them now the money for back him and you know what I mean? Enhance him career. So that island is a commonwealth of Britain. So him run for Great Britain. And Coach Mills coach him. And trust me, you can't see our Jamaican coaches. Believe me. You know what I mean? Me are root for Titans, you know. The Titans are my club, you know. Yeah, man. Titans. Yeah, with um, Daniel. I should name again. With Brianna Williams and Akeem Blake, you and Blake, you know what I mean? But anyway, big up to them, alright? Me I wait for see. Me I watch the 200 meter final yet, so me I know what go on. Alright, anyway, Taekwondo posts this video and he's saying that we all saw that he came fifth in the 100 meter finals at the National Trials in Jamaica in June. Now, he earned his spot in the relay pool. Now, what he's saying is very disturbing. Now, he's saying that the head coach of the J3 that responsible for making all the important decisions took him off the team, brought in his own athlete, never told anybody about it. His athlete didn't make the team. And now, you're bumping Taekwondo Tracy for your athlete, and that has been going on for years. But it takes somebody with guts who believe in what he believes in and believe justice and believes injustice anywhere is a threat to justice everywhere so i commend taekwondo tracy for come out come speak do you understand me you earn your spot blood track and field is not just get up and run the man train 12 months two weeks two hours two minutes two seconds two nanosecond two no not at all till the boil back down till he start over go right back up to 12 months and you're gonna kick this man off this man got a college in a blood this man the construction as he stated he doesn't do it for the money he does it to represent his country because that's an honor to represent the country on a global stage you know what i mean and taekwondo tracy he has a lot of bouts with injuries plagued by injuries but he's a fighter and you get a chance for rip and somebody's gonna kick you off and now when he questioned that decision by the coach now i'm speaking of what taekwondo tracy is saying i don't know the next side of the story so i always reserve the truth for three sides until the three sides are born out my side your side and the truth but so this is just taekwondo tracy side so i'm just speaking on what he's saying reacting to what he's saying but if and i use that word strongly if which is the operative if what taekwondo tracy is saying if there's any truth to it he was wrong. He was terribly wrong. And that is not fair. And who is the body that governs the body that governs the J3? Hmm? I know that Jamaica has been a friend for all thing. Long time. 
long time from the reggae boys come straight back i want to say reggae boys we mean the under 20s the under 17s yeah because from long time you see i was a coach you know not a, co a manager around football team for years my club over 10 years so i'm in the thing be a national me can name out a whole heap of them i say when them go to the national trials and them have game when they come from certain year them they even call you to come on a team and them stigmatize you and put you up on the b team if you got judges jc and come from uptown you not getting a game you not getting a game and enough of them quit me i tell you baller right now can come in at the comment section and we tell them me not call a name but me know enough of them god believe me me know them me know them, them get wrong. You think them never know say Pele, uh, Pepe a baller for a long time? You think them never know? Yo, a compulsion monkey work post man. I couldn't, them couldn't do no better. Why them jar for Pepe? And if I never, René Simoes, Pepe would have never see the light that he come from which Olympic come play for so He must be mad. Him know that. Pepe know that. You think Pepe an idiot? You think Pepe an idiot? But guess what? When him get him chance, believe me, I one of the best defense me ever. Some people are gonna say Tati Brown, but me I gonna say Pepe. You see, if Pepe did have just a own small speed. There's nobody me can say, Tati, you can't read the game still. We have Pepe, but Pepe just have something else over him. The grit and Pepe, he make up for lack of pace with reading the game. He's very, very brilliant. And he know for intercept. Just like Tati. They were two different players. Me now compare them. We told them the grit in them own way. But back to Taekwondo. I think Taekwondo should retain his spot because now he's been kicked off the team because he spoke up. Spoke up for his right. And now allegations are being conjured up out of nowhere. And they want to pull his accredited and send him back home because he protested nah man fear is fear bro when you run you know for your team you know that have a whole lot to do with the sponsorship you know determine how you get paid when you get paid if your team qualify who run get the most money so you not only a ramp with the man with reputation you are ramp with the money you are ramp you, you playing with this man's bag bro you playing with taekwondo's bag bro you can't do that but anyway, listen to the video. Blessings. Everyone, everyone. Leave a comment. Might do a part two. Taekwondo, Please if you want to speak, bro, DM me. Or do an interview. Alright? Bless up. Well, good. Stay in touch. Go and listen to the video. What is going on here in Budapest for me, Taekwondo Tracy? And what I'm faced with at the moment. So, right now, based on what I know, I am officially off the 4x1. I won't be competing due to um what i can say is favoritism due to this gentleman here maurice wilson um he's as some may know the head coach of the team and i'm being replaced by an athlete which being replaced is not my major problem at the moment is who and how i'm being replaced right i did my due diligence and got to the national championships and made sure I did what I needed to do to be selected for the team. I was selected. Um, you can see the, the, um, the selection from J3 that was released. But I knew it was something a bit off when we got to Budapest for the training camp. When we got there, there was an additional person. This person no one knew of him being selected for the team and of course this person is coached by maurice wilson the head coach of the national team right when we got there and training everything was going well training start doing a lot of button passes i was out there getting ready to run the third leg and um fast forward to when we got here to the, the official era in Budapest and training started again for the, for the relays. I noticed a shift, especially after the, this was, the big shift I noticed was after the mixed relays. For whatever reason, and I don't necessarily want to speak on what happened on the mixed relays because it has nothing to do with me directly. The persons who are involved with that, if they choose to, that's up to them. But what I'm saying, and Oral Tracy, Oral Tracy basically gave a very good view of what happened on that mixed relay. An extremely clear view on what happened on that mixed relay. Um, so when we got here, and um, after the mix-up, everybody started scampering around. So now they're saying, oh, um, they can't afford to mess up again, so they need to put the best teams out there. So of course, when I got to the meeting, 
most people would know that we are there are normally six persons for the relay pool, right? This time around, it's seven with the addition of Maurice Wilson's athlete who did not make the team because he wasn't selected from our knowledge. From what I understand, they selected him and they didn't release that to the public, but he was a part of the team and it was a surprise for everybody. We came here and he's here. There has been a whole heap of bias and privileges people have been gotten as a lot of people like to say that a links get your places in a Jamaica right and this right here so is a prime example because an athlete is not supposed to be on the team and he's here because his coach is the head coach of the team and when you also think about it right if they're going to say oh this person ran XYZ time that's not a valid point you have Julian Ford, Kishian Thomas, and Johan Blake, who has run faster than him more than once. Right? But unfortunately, they didn't make the team, but their coach isn't the national, the head coach, which him, Maurice Wilson, would like to have people think that he has nothing with, nothing to do with the athlete being here. Right? And from my point of view, I am feeling extremely cheated and I feel like Mr. Wilson has a personal vendetta against me for whatever reason I don't know because this is not the first time I'm, I've been in a situation where I am being replaced by one of his athletes right today I've been well for the longest while I've been trying to you know sort this out so basically what they're trying to tell me now is i should just forget about how we got here i should think about the fact that he's here and they are going to run him on the team now here is the joke they select a five member team right they're only going to run five persons i michael campbell is not on that five right and they included kj and Gosen, who shouldn't even be here in the first place Right, they are going to run him in the heats and then replace him with Watson, from my knowledge. And the people who are in charge of this team are trying to act blind to the fact that there are some fishiness going on, right, and don't want to speak out against it. They are trying to be as diplomatic as possible because over the years, if you don't know, J3 has been well, people has try to speak out against J3 and it's like certain things just don't go well for them afterwards right so you have a lot of people who don't want to say nothing about them so today you know I ended up doing an interview with TVJ which should be released shortly before this video and right after the interview I they said they needed to you know get some word from Wilson because this 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 is not this is not right I mean principle is principle and as a principal of a university I would think he would know something about principle right when we when he got when they went over there and I was I was being a bit a bit of a a bit of a miscreant in a sense right and I went over there as well and when they were trying to ask him the questions, I went there and, and stood up. I just stood up and I went like this, but my hat was the other way. And I was looking at him because I wanted to hear his response to the questions. And he was, because he wasn't saying these things on camera, of course. He was trying to answer certain things and try to, to avoid doing the interview. So he was talking to them and I was there listening. And when he looked up and saw me, he looked into my face and he said, he asked me, can I help you? I said, no, no. I'm just standing here. And then he also said to me, said, do you want something? He said, no, I'm just there, you know, just like everybody else. I'm just here. So then he said to the reporters that, you know what? Can we take this somewhere else? Because I, I don't know what this is. So I'm like, when we might take this somewhere else, is this something you're saying that you don't want me to hear? Right? 
So then I walked away and I, I walked away to like maybe like about 30, 40 feet away from him and I leaned on this um, column and I was listening to him talk. And I couldn't hear much. So then I walked away and I said, I shouted, God, I hope you're watching. I don't know if you heard, but I shouted, hoping he would, right? Because I would think he's a man of God, or I guess, I don't know, right? So, shortly after I received a phone call, I know this is where things get, things get childish, because that's the best way I can put it. This is where things get childish. So I got a phone call from the security liaison for us. Because I think everybody on the team, every team is supposed to have like a security person there, somebody that is in charge of security, right? Got a call and uh, he, the, the, he sounded a bit, you know, like upset because I know, I know him and he know me and he, I, he always speaks in high regard of me because I'm a nice person until you try to cross me, in a sense. You respect me, I respect you, you disrespect me. If you're an elder, you probably get two chance, but... You get the drift, right? Um, he said that um, he got a call from Mr. Wilson telling him, him to pull my accreditation and get me off the team because I disrespected him and was going on and on and off and off. So I said, so I'm there and I'm like, wait, 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 what do you mean? And he must say, yeah, he must say, disrespect him and we need to get you off of the team and pull your accreditation just because i'm fighting for what i think and what i truly believe is my right okay so he wants to get rid of me now and when afterwards he was i said listen 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 i won't explain myself to you i'm going to call three persons name these three persons were there while whatever took place took place Ask them and then come back to me and tell me what they said. Right? Because if I'm going to say I didn't do this, it's going to be word of mouth. And I mean, if they should go to court, I think a jury would believe a principal of a university over Taiko in the church. Right? So I said, listen, there were people here. Ask them. Ask them what I said to him. Ask them how I disrespected him in a way for him to want to get me off the team. Get me out of Budapest. Right? These are the things some of us athletes face because there are countless times and if we do the research, the proper research, you will see that there are athletes who shouldn't be on the team, are on the team. And most times, they all are affiliated with him right so if you, you as a coach a principal a human being are messing with other people's career just for your own personal gain right I came here with the notion that I was going to compete and all of a sudden just because you you, you, you guys messed up and you know they are blaming you as the head coach for what happened because remember you were the one who said whatever selection is made you have to sign off on it in terms of release I have been training for 12 months, 2 weeks and 2 days and you are telling me that I should just forget about all of my hard work my coach went to speak to him and from what I heard what he said to my coach I should just relax because everybody's going to get paid you think I'm doing this for money you think this is just for the money the money is a bonus if I was that desperate when it comes to money I would just go I would go, go straight into construction I would just go straight into what I've been doing in college right so you all say all oh, you you everybody's going to get paid from what i know only persons who run get money and medal i'm here for the medal i'm here to compete i'm here to represent jamaica i'm not here to make you feel comfortable 
if you wanted to feel comfortable, you would have prepared your athlete properly to make sure they did what they needed to do at the championship. My coach did. Right? So, fix. I don't expect anything to be fixed because you changing whatever is going on right now is going to be an admission of guilt. We all know that. But all I'm saying is that this matter right here, I'm going to press it until the very end. Because I'm not going to, 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 to just walk away from this. You are a very evil and vindictive person. You are unfair. And you have been doing this for more than one, uh, for a while now. And you have been getting away with it. And as I said, I am not going to let this slide. Because this is my career. This is my life. You are fooling around with this. I am not no toy for you. I don't know if you have toys at your house, but I am not one of them. So, I guess we will see how this plays out in the next less than two days, less than 48 hours. I guess we will see how it plays out because obviously he desperately wants his athlete to compete while he went through the lens of, of making sure that nobody knew that he was selected for the team. Now when I think about it, it, it just don't make any sense. Right? You're trying to you're trying to make sense of nonsense and try to make people who have a little bit of brain look like they have none. But we will see how this plays out everyone. Thanks for watching. I'm going to share this because this news needs to get everywhere. Because it's a matter of, it's a national matter. I mean, it's a national team. So, do what you need to do. Thank you. I am Joy. Peppa. You know the real J Tenga. Huh? How I go, sometimes the road tough side slow. <laughs> Real patriots never buck, never fall. Oh, yeah. How they get around, that's why. Talk from the boy, who don't do that. Who? Uh -huh. Who don't can't kill with Jai, who don't go? Who from your soul don't know what wrong go? Yo, yeah. eh. And a man bust a shot him off a pack up and go Mind it on him head back and go Pop off him strap on him friend him for do None of that guy eh. No assumption I saw the ground run Power Married to corruption Criminal Bread from limited options Ten generation I see the said song One one head man will live long Name one Things will ever be ruined not done Name one One good and his politician Name one and get a youth resilient That's what Back from the boy who no do that Boy Who no can't kill with joy Who no boy Who from your soul don't know what wrong boy Yo 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 a man better boy And a man bust a shot him off a back up and go Bind it on him head back and go Pop off him strap on him friend him for do None of that yo a man better Things risky For the misfit Death rate fit the logistic Chris Chris Ha I want the biscuit man Eight of crackers with a whiskey. Uh -huh. mm. You're not listening. Uh -huh. Crime live here, so it's not visiting. Visitors, careful, you know what the business is. Murder, plunder, pillaging, who? Oh. Bloodshed in all the villages. You name it, you will live in it. Get rich, I do a special delivery. Nightmare, in tormented images. Vengeance, bloody cycle continuing, but. No you see that but it's no revenge Looking at the mirror there is no different Man we full of hey. How we know we trends back from the boy who no do that Who? Uh. Who no can't kill with child? Who no go? Uh. Who from your so we don't know how around go? Uh. Yup, now I'm on better uh. Any man does not shut him off a back up and go Mind it on him head back and go uh. Pop off him strap on him friend him for do None of that yo I'm on better uh. No assumption, I saw the ground run uh. Power, married to corruption, criminal, red from limited options. 
10 generation Pass in the set song One one ten man will live long Name one, one. Wim say fella We know Who oh, name one One and this politician Name one who Then get to you three zillion Fuck from the boy we no do that Four. Can't kill with child on the back Who from your soul don't know what wrong go eh ah. Yo Yo a man better go eh Any man bust a shot him off a pack a pack Four. Fighting on him head back Come four Pop off him strap on him friend him Do a eh Who no know that how they got Eh Yo You know the team going up set a seat up a beat you know Eh hey man Take your two man Four Four man Man to them purple Four man to them purple